Today we are going to be looking at the One Series thermal camera. Now some people have actually seen this camera about before, however though in this case here let's just take a better look. So on the actual camera, let's take the fly lead here, so of course we've got alarm in and out, we also have audio in and out, we've got a 12 volt jack and of course the standard RJ45 connection. But the actual camera itself, we have infrared on this camera, we also have the white light strobe for active deterrent, we have a visual lens and we also have a thermal lens, okay? This tiny little camera is completely packed full of features. Now this 4 megapixel camera does have three different millimeter ratings. Two useful features are cooling detection and smoking detection as well. So if you were to smoke in front of this camera and you happen to be in the field of view, the active deterrent will go off, so the light will um, trigger, and the siren on the bottom will also trigger as well. The same again whenever it's cooling detection. If you were to raise your hand next to your head, and of course it would have its best guess that you are on the telephone, then of course the active deterrents will kick in again. Attention, mobile phone use is prohibited in this area. Now, very familiar like other artificial intelligent cameras, we of course obviously have IVS, Intelligent Video System. Now this one also does have the object classification, so it does know the difference between a human and a vehicle within the field of view. If you set the parameter to be human only, if a human was to walk into that scene, the alarm would trigger. If a motor vehicle went past, then of course it would do nothing. Now, Fire detection on this thermal camera is a very important key element. Now when it comes down to the actual fire detection, then of course this camera has the ability to be able to see the actual fire. It looks like fire, it moves like fire, so it must be fire, the alarm will trigger. Another type of camera that we have in thermal is temperature detection. Whenever a thermal camera sees a area and of course it's radiating heat, a thermal imaging temperature camera can actually tell the actual temperature with a, a one degree offset under and over and then of course in this case here if it gets too hot the alarm will fire. That's a temperature detection camera. This one is a fire detection camera. As you will see now, I've set up four fires in the back garden and of course it is triggering immediately based on how it moves as fire. So in this case here, it is an excellent option. When it comes down to thermal imaging technology, we also have filters. We can use multiple filters to be able to adjust the thermal view so then you can actually see, you know, possibly heat differentials in a different type of light. You can actually see the actual filters and color filters so that way it makes it look a bit more hypnotic or in fact actually in some cases whenever you ad adjust it to maybe like um, red hot and black hot then of course in this case here whenever you have this white scene and then a human comes into the field of view and you see this black like object then of course immediately then of course you can actually tell somebody is within the actual view you don't need to second guess thermal imaging makes it easy for that now where are we actually going to use a one series thermal camera well the high likelihood is it's going to be in perimeter protection now we of course obviously have TOC2. TOC2 comes with SMD 3.0 smart motion detection and prior to the actual scene, the field of view, the application, the environment, maybe TOC2 can actually see somebody going over the line, over the intrusion detection area, maybe 50, 60, 70 odd meters away. When it comes down to thermal imaging, then of course it's a lot easier to see a heat signature go over the line opposed to the study of multi-megapixel change, for example. So of course, like in this case here, uh, our products range from somebody going over the line maybe one meter away, all the way up to four kilometers away. Granted, on those cameras, the lens will be the same size as a football, but of course, obviously, it could be done. In this camera here, then of course, I can get possibly double the distance on the actual intrusion detection area of a hot subject going over the line than I can a regular IPC camera. Okay, we're out here in the car park testing the One Series thermal camera. I am currently 90 meters away from the camera. This is the four millimeter version. I've set up a trip wire over there. And then of course, whenever I walk by, I will see and hear the flashing light and I will hear the siren. I can't actually see the camera, it's too far away for me. So uh, let's just do this uh, quick test.
Excellent. Okay, so that was a success. The camera recorded all of that and it was one, one hit take. So now we should actually do something based on a actual perimeter. So of course, like whenever you invade the area, whenever you invade the space, let's set up the actual camera. Let's do like a, a boundary line, the best place for perimeter protection. And let's test again. Okay, this is where we will see the benefits of thermal technology. So this is our boundary line and that is our no-go area. Once I cross the actual boundary, then the alarm will trigger immediately. Perfect. Now we're gonna do a quick audio test. I'm just gonna take a step out so we can avoid the feedback. This is a audio test of the One Series Thermal Camber. You have been detected on CCTV. Please leave the area. This is a darkness test and we will clearly see the benefits of thermal technology. Okay guys, start turning off your lights. Turn all lights off. Oh, complete pitch black. Okay, camera's up there somewhere. Everyone wave. Excellent. The views that you see from the video are in fact actually taken from my back garden and that's because I own a one series thermal camera. I'm not gonna part with it. I think it's an excellent device. It's just completely packed full of features. Okay guys, I think this is gonna be a excellent product for this market. Okay, don't forget to like, hit the bell and subscribe for more great content. All the best.